Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls series. How do I help I get out of here? Right here. Uh, so I had to go down and grab some iron. I did a lot of stuff last night. I got a lot of things sorted. So I think I'm going to sell... Well, I know I'm going to sell all of my old... Um, uh, all of my old military gear. I've already got that mostly sold. Um, I want to make sure everything is updated here before we start the horde tonight. Uh, let's go outside on this side. I had to grab some iron. That's why I was down in the mine. Because we got to replace a lot of this stuff. So they almost broke through here. Yeah, so that's bad. Um, let's get some of this repaired out here. It's weird that they got right behind the spikes and, able to, and were able to do that. Um, this should dry by tonight, so I'm not worried. Yeah, they just like... Broke straight through them. So even though the door is open, they don't always see it as a way to get to me. Which, I mean, I kind of figured that, but... I just was hoping it was going to be a little better than that, I guess. Uh, do that. Then let's do, um... Kick you out of my hot bar for now. Put you down here. And we'll do... On face. Get those replaced and updated. So, we're almost at 100,000 um, dukes. So, that should put us... Oh, see, they were standing on that. That should put us pretty darn close to what we need. So, I'm thinking we should be able to head back out to go see uh, Caitlyn. Get these guys in there. Nope. Uh, we should be able to go back out and see Caitlyn. Uh, maybe tomorrow. But hopefully... Um, I'm going to put that in there too, just in case. They seem to like this spot. And hopefully she'll have the two things we need, which is the... Um, uh, what's it called? The Fusion Forge and the... There we go. And the, uh, what's it called? Um, laser workbench. She had them last time we were there. Well, at least the, one, of the, one of the two of them had it. Wow, they actually uh, did damage to the top, eh? Okay, let's do that. Because apparently upgrading stuff past level, uh, what was it, 60? No. Oh, for fuck's sakes, I missed that three times. All right. Um, upgrading stuff past a certain point um, requires the laser workbench. Yeah, see, they don't even touch this back. I don't, I don't even know why they don't touch back here. But we might as well update all of this stuff. Because that first level after this is still all cobble. Except for where they broke through here. Right? I want them to kind of break through so I can replace some of that. Uh, this should all be fine, pretty much. I don't think they did anything out here. A little bit here. I think that was between hordes, though. Okay, a little bit of damage here. I think as long as this is maxed out, it gives them less of an incentive to actually attack it. Alright, well, and you're dead. Are you? Did they get you? Is he gone? I guess he's dead. How do they get him? That's what I want to know. How were they able to get in there to get this guy?
like I made that super strong. I don't know. Call him bullshit on that one. All right, they finally knocked that plate out. So let's go ahead and copy the rotation here. Ooh, copy shape too. Apparently I can't. Put that in. All right, well, I think we'll be fine. The only thing we got to worry about is the behemoths and stuff coming up to coming up to the door, right? As long as we can avoid that, we should be just fine. Like I haven't even done these yet. Okay, they took a little bit off this post. I don't know if they aggro onto these guards or what. Maybe we should probably put just a little extra protection for the guards up there. It's not much, but it's better than nothing. And then I think we go around. So I think we're okay. I think we're okay out here. Some of that barbed wire, I guess. Yeah, we're slowly losing, like, our corner's gone here. No guards there, no guard here. They're slowly all going away. Not much I can do about it. We got the two down here still, though. I'm kind of shocked at that. Don't know how they're still, I don't know how they're still there. Uh, I think we avoid putting stuff down there to slow the zombies up. I don't want them hitting the corner. Okay. Well... All right, that can get updated. Now we got one more over here. I keep forgetting to do this one. That corner got knocked out too, so hopefully we can update that. All this is all this has been repaired. So we're pretty good here. That should protect the wire from anything blowing up out here. Okay. I've been repairing this too as we go along. I was going to repair that. Those I don't really care about. Now you... You know what we're going to do? We're going to make this this. And then hopefully I can't shoot you. Might as well block this up too. And then let's come on this side. Fix that. Those should be steel. Let's take this out. Shit. That should be on face, shouldn't it? Okay, we're going to do that. Then I wonder if we put down... That. I don't think it's going to make that much difference. But at least we have something here to help Defender. How much steel do I have here? Enough for 18, eh? Okay, that should at least protect that. Okay, now I got more of this upstairs. I got as much as I could get going last night. I think it was like 400 and something. More steel. I think it should probably be done. Pretty darn close to being done. Yeah, it is. Okay, so uh, we can update a little bit more out there. We got gunpowder cooking. We got ammo on the craft. Is that done? It's all done. If that's done. Uh, I'm sure, I'm forgetting something. What am I forgetting, guys? What am I forgetting? 
Uh, except for how to jump. This is probably the last night for these. How are we doing ammo-wise? I did check these, didn't I? 300 rounds left. Empty. I think we put them in the bottom ones, didn't we? 300 and a bit. And you. Right, because your plate is broken, I think. Right? No, your plate's not broken. So let's put... This one fires a lot more, so let's make sure that's full. And then let's put this back in there. Okay, we still be confident, confident that's going to be fine. This block I don't think is ever going to dry. Um, okay. That protected. Of the door. Okay, did that dry down there? Not yet. Uh, I think Caitlin's safe. They should just see, like, they should just come up here. I think they should just come up here. All right. Um, okay, that's good there. All right, now what? Uh, I don't think we need to do much else. I think we're really ready to go. It's just like doing a bit more upgrading. Like a handful of these blocks, like that block there needs to be done. I don't really need to do the walls or anything. Uh, yeah. Dude, you had the time. It's 10 in the morning. Okay, we're kind of ahead of the game here. Thanks anyways. You be yeah, that's right. There. That's all right. Uh, where are you here? That's the one we want. Okay. Um, what do I want to do now? Actually, let's go downstairs. I made these last night with some of the parts that we had. Uh, we can sell these guys. Three of each of these. SMGs, this can go. The lays can go. These guys can go. He didn't she didn't want that. Those can go. And these guys are all currently up to date and selling. I sold a bunch of them last night. I made about like six thousand or something like that, or five thousand, somewhere around there. Okay, you notice I got a seventy one coil rifle on well, me you're now. Here early. What can I do for you? Uh, I gotta sell you some stuff. Because I want to go see Caitlyn later. Oop. Don't want those. Won't buy the coil, eh? Really? No sell price. Really? So you can't? That's interesting. Sell these three. So we made 17,000. That's pretty good. I'm kind of glad I made these now. 550 a pop. That's not bad. Okay. Thanks for letting me take care of you. Yeah, thanks for being here. And Actually, you have... Uh, uh, you know what? We're going to hang on to our money. We'll buy stuff off you if we need to next time. But right now, we don't need to. So I'm going to run with the coil rifle tonight for as long as I can. We have a ton of coil ammo. Like, we've got tons of ammo here. we got three stacks here, plus another three here. So we should be good. Got the coil rifle we'll bring out as well. Um, I'm going to have the... Probably one of these guys with AP ammo. So we'll have that. 
the shotgun we'll be using for most of the zombies, I think, at the door. We'll just switch up to the coil. All right, let's put this stuff in here. Trying to convince myself this is the right way to go. I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure it'll be fine. So we've got... So in a couple of days, we've got like 115,000 now. Plus we sell the other stuff, right? I can make a few more things. That gives us 120,000, which is exactly what we need to buy the two items that we need. We need 125, but that's just splitting hairs. That's easy to get. So we only need another 10,000, which is easy. Awesome. And, uh, how is this put in wrong? Shit, that's bad. That's really bad. How the hell did I put that in wrong? Um, what? <laughs> what the hell? I'm sure I didn't put it in wrong. Because I checked it. Let's make two. We'll have a backup. Uh, no. Yes. You. Uh, you. And then we can put you and you in there. Uh, how the hell did I get that in wrong? Okay, we gotta break it out now. Shit, you know what else I'm forgetting to do? Oh god, it's, it's hitting the wrong thing. There we go. I gotta go check out the turrets. And repair the, um... The wires, too. Okay, that guy down there is done. You know what it is? You know why I got this wrong? If you notice the top of the... Like, like where the other hatch is... I was looking at its hinges thinking I was putting this in correctly. That was what happened. Because the thing about these hatches is it's easy to see where the hinges have to go. So I'm like, oh, I don't need to make an iron one or a wood one. I can just match the hinges up. And I put it down. I'm like, oh, great. The hinges match up. And I didn't even think to look on the left. It just looks like the hinges are on the, on the top there. That's what happened. Okay, let's uh, get that repaired. Can I reach this from up here? No, of course I can't. Okay, that's ready to go. Oh uh, man, what am I missing? Everything's been repaired. This has all been repaired. All this has been repaired and updated. We got enough spikes in here, I think. I mean, we could layer another layer down here. I think that might help a little bit. Okay, that's that done. Let's do this and this. You're punting them off this way down here so they can get back up. This is fine here. Uh, I don't care about those ones because they're not really doing anything over there. All right. Several things I got to remember. Doors have to be open. I got to pull up that block. Is there a damage block here? Pull up the block in front of the door. Uh, right, electrical, mechanical parts. Electrical, mechanical. Get down here. Make sure you're fixed. So they didn't do too much damage to those. Those are repaired. That's all good. That, like, that's all protected. I think we protect, we protect this too. So I got on both sides here. Okay, I can probably... Well, let's leave that open for now. Uh, okay. Um, what am I doing? Hatches. That needs to get sold. Okay, so... Yeah, see, I did that thinking that that was the hat, the uh, latch up there. There we go. So that'll be correct now. Perfect. 
Not that it matters, those freaking behemoths like eat through that like it's water. All right, now you. You are good for ammo. Don't need to be repaired. And both of you guys are okay. Beautiful. Okay, let's close this. All right, we can take this out of here. I think we're good on most of this stuff. Handful of blocks need some repairs, but not much. Right, because there's plates on the outside. That's right. That's why. I updated, I fixed the plates, but I didn't fix these blocks. Okay, makes sense. All right. Uh, I don't have to worry about those. That's, po that's fixed. That's okay. You're running those guys. You run the dart traps. Might as well just do that. So they don't break throughout the night. I hear a zombie. Nope, I guess I didn't. Okay. I'm feeling okay now. I think we're going to be okay. We got to pick these up. Close the door. Pick up that thing down there. Open all these doors down here. Find out what time it is. Dude, how are you doing? How's your crotch today? It is almost two o'clock. So oh, let's. My apologies. Check back again, and I may have what you're looking for. I don't know. Packages ain't gonna grow in between now and the next time I see you, unless you get some kind of miracle grow going on that thing. Uh, let's throw that in there. Uh, that can go in there. All right, let's pull out what we need for the horde tonight. The looting goggles for the end of the night. There's no way I'm doing, like, wooden blocks are just a waste of time. Although the frames, uh, we should probably, just in case I need to pull up somewhere. Do need water? I don't need the lock picks. So that can go here for now. I'm not going to need the wrench, nor the shovel, nor this. Probably not that. Uh, there's no repairing, so we can't use that. Coil rifle first. P225, I think, can probably sit tonight out. Let's see what we got in here. So we do have secondary coil rifles and stuff. Uh, coil sniper, let's bring you out. So we're not going to need a 9mm ammo. Let's bring out the AP762. Let's bring out M4A1. We'll switch everything off of this guy onto the M4. Uh, what else do we have here? All the coil rounds. Okay, let's just switch out this stuff first. So, modify you. Complete. Modify you. Uh, important stuff first. In case I act, in case I have to re like repair tonight some at some point. Range damage is 124, 111 magazine size 44, 22. It's not that big of a deal. So let's leave you there. I don't know if I can use the stock on. Can I use it on this guy? Beautiful. So the damage on this guy is 102. This isn't bad. Let's get AP rounds in you. So you're for demos and stuff. This guy is for everybody else. High powered AP coil rounds. That's another thing we should be looking at doing at some point. Are you loaded? You're loaded. Okay, let's uh, set up the ammo here so we can quickly look at a glance how much we have while we're fighting. 
I think this is going to be way more than enough shotgun rounds, so we're going to just go with this set, the uh, three stacks. Those guys can go back in there. We're going to need that. This has to be down here. Actually, let's bring it up closer to the front. Uh, let's not drop it. Let's bring it up closer to the front. So we'll just run with the three weapons, I think. Um, now, for first aid... These bandages are useless. Keep that on us. And keep that on us. Let's keep some of those on us. Actually, let's bring them all down here. I would have double stacked that. Like that. That's just in case we break something. Um, in case of concussion. Take one of those before we start. We'll have one just in case. I'm not worried about infection. I think that's about all we need out of here. Right? Yeah, looks that way. So this is in this increases rifle damage, but increases the spread. And reduces the aim and a ton of water. So those are really like oh shit buttons if you're in close. But I don't need that right now. Alright, uh, this stuff goes in here. Don't need anything out of there. Let's take this stack. Uh, for hydration. I'm going to burn two of these. Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's burn two of these tonight. Keep some food on us. Let's cook some food up. We need sham and we need... Can of stocks. It's 10. How many bowls do we have? 11. Cool. So let's go ahead. Did I make... I haven't actually made the other the stove yet? Oh, man, I should make that. Uh, not right now, because if I do, I'll forget to do other stuff. I don't have any wood. So of course I don't. I guess I could have melted frames, but... There's just something about that just seems so weird. Okay, I think that should do it, right? Oh, crappy before, really? Alright, let's get that going. We'll put that away. Uh, so we got some more food in the craft. Got water, learning elixir. Okay, well, I think we're ready. Why do I feel so panicked? What's our armor rating at? I'm interested to see this. 53, so half the damage we don't take. That's well, not too bad, I guess. We still got half decent movement, which is, you know, really what I care about. Being able to get away from the enemy is, like, really important. Four deaths, though. I kind of hate that. But we're at gain stage 326, level 101. So I'm interested to see what we get tonight. We're at Warrior Difficulty, um, which isn't too, too bad. You know what we should do, though? Uh, before I forget, let's grab uh, mechanical parts and springs, and then let's grab some steel. This is something I should have done. And then we want to do Vault Door, Craft U, get that done. And now I need to keep some of this on me. Though those can go in there. Let's bring you down for a second, because I'm going to need you. Uh, steel. Oh, I need to steal on me for a brief moment. Let's keep this out. Let's bring this out. See how much steel we can make here. 600. All right. Let's get this going so it'll be done by tomorrow. So we'll have some for, re for repairs here. I'm going to have to go down below and uh, get a crap ton of mining done next time. That's that done. Uh, let's get some iron out of there. Only 600 left. Forged iron. Do you have the ability to make forged iron? I don't think you do. You don't have an anvil in you. Oh, we don't have an anvil? Why do we don't have anvils in these things. Oh, we do have anvils. 
Why won't you make uh, forged iron? What are we missing? There's an anvil in there. Oh, now there is. Wow, it wouldn't shift click in. That's weird. Wow, that's so bizarre. All right, how much can we make? 120? All right, let's just split it up. Okay, well. Let's get this door. Because we're going to go ahead and do this. There we go. Something I should have done before the, like, before the last horde, but that's fine. All that's done. Okay. Are we ready? I don't feel ready. Let's see what my skills are now. Uh, let's see here. So we've got eight skill points. And what masteries are we missing? Can't do this yet because we need to have... I think future technology requires ten of these. Future is now. We need... Yeah, we need ten. So we're getting there. Okay, so skills. So we've got Master Survivalist, Master Security, Master... We don't have Master Science yet. Okay. Oh, we did. Master Scavenger, Mechanic, I know we had. Builder, I know we had. We need Hunter, Farmer. We need four of them. Wow, okay. I kind of want to do it with skill notes, but... So weapon crafting is bows and clubs. Get you turned up. Tool crafting, I'm not really that worried about. Survivor is... Reduce food and water loss. Don't need pack meal at the moment. Okay, plumbing for dumb shits. This gives us the working sink. And this gives the working oven. I know I'm spending it before the horde, but it's like, yeah, why not? Uh, okay, now, um, over here, though, I think we're just, we're fine. Automatic rifles. We can go another one. So that'll help out tonight. And then, pistols we got maxed out. Brawling's maxed out. Bladed I don't care about. Shotgun weapons are maxed out. So rifles, this is like sniper rifles, I guess, eh? Like, I don't know if this is coil rifle. But we're going to take that. We'll see. I, I don't know if coil rifles put underneath this category or if it's under automatic weapons. But we'll find out tonight because we're using this most of the while. For the big boys, we're using it. And then um, when we got uh, the regular guys at the door, we'll just use the shotgun. AP is for demolishers, etc. Okay, let's put those away. Use that. Okay, there's the uh, first warning. Put you back in there. All right, buddy. You ready for tonight? I don't know that you are. I don't know that you are. You're protected behind steel though, so I shouldn't shoot you. I want to drop one of them below, just in case. Might as well leave that open. Okay, we're going up this way. This door's got to be closed. Pick this up. Let's get these open. That should just... No, it doesn't. I think I need to do both of them that way. Or 
right? Yep, beautiful. Let's get these doors open. Look at this, guys. We're not forgetting anything tonight. I say until we get inside the, uh... Until we get in here and go, Oh, shit, I forgot to... I don't know what that would be yet. Okay, we got the turret up and running. We got the power turned on here in a second. Going with both of these doors. Why can't I... Why can't I access the door? It's just not registering, that's all. Oh, come on. Leave that one down for now. This is the oh shit we need to get out of here door. Dark traps on. Turrets and power on. Because I'm paranoid. Yeah. Just gotta make sure that we're not gonna be in trouble. <sighs> what am I forgetting? I feel like I'm forgetting something. What am I forgetting? I uh, know, I think I'm good. I think we're good. Oh, we got like an hour left. It's hard to tell. Because it's cloudy, right? Alright. Well, at least she's protected down there tonight. Shouldn't be shooting her in any way. Everything's inside and all protected. We don't have AP um, ammo for the uh, coil rifles, so I shouldn't be blowing through the walls with it. The M4A2, though... That's, or M4A1, that's a possibility. But if I can stick the shotgun mostly at the door here, depending on what we get, if I can stay with shotgun mostly, then we shouldn't be damaging this wall all that much at all. And what am I forgetting? Doors are open. That's been picked up, but that door is closed. The ramp's gone here. Turret's ready upstairs. Uh, Alright, I guess really it just depends on how many demons we're getting tonight. That's going to be a coil rifle rinse, hopefully at the door. I don't, I don't know if demons get affected by electricity. So I'll have to see. I'm kind of nervous about this. I have to rethink this base because I, I think moving forward... Like once we get the big boys here... Because we haven't gotten the really big boys yet. This is going to just fail. So i got to think about how we're going to do it. we gotta, we got to limit their ability to see us. So those demons don't shoot fire at us. Right, so as long as I'm here, they shouldn't be able to see me. I can from there, though. So maybe these need to be hatches. Or a door that... No, I think two hatches would be better. Because if one gets destroyed, we still have another one. Yeah, I don't know. I still don't know. Maybe we have the ability to go out and over. So we can shoot straight down. And then if something gets crazy, we can come in here and, and fight in here. I don't know. Or maybe we do what I used to do with my old bases is... That's a wandering horde. Yep. My old bases, I used to... Um, got a Bernie. My old bases, I used to have doors that they used to have to break through. And then I would be over on the side of the door, shooting across. Right? And then that way, like, I wasn't, like, right at their face. I could shoot them from the side. 
And at this point, that's probably a good idea because, like, I don't have to be right here. Although it does make it easier to, to take their heads off with a shotgun. But at a certain point, the shotgun's going to be no good anyway. I don't know. Yeah, this is about the only time I wish I had a watch. Pretty darn close, though. Take this first. Then we'll take the learning elixir. They're going to hear me shooting and they'll be coming over here anyway, so... I'm kind of torn. I think what we do between this horde and the next one... I think 70 is going to be particularly bad. We should probably focus on a couple of things. One, dropping the trader. Get her down below into the mines. Um, two, going out and getting titanium. So we can update all this to titanium. And three, figure out what we're going to do about this. Because if I'm not allowed to repair, I don't know how I'm going to survive this. Three hatches just aren't, is not going to be enough if it's all behemoths and stuff here. I have to find a way to keep them off. We need to get a second turret, sledge turret going, pun punting most of them off to keep the steady, like, slow flow of traffic to the door. And then maybe it's like I said, maybe we're out over here shooting this way. What would be kind of neat, though, is if we were out this way, they run by me, and then I'm shooting that way. So I'm not, like, they can't see me. They have to come around to the door. We could extend it here, have them come past, and come around to this side. And then I could push this out a bit and be sh No, that doesn't work. I gotta do it so that... Well, like here, while they're coming up, they can't see me. Because those demons are gonna shoot fire at me, and the cops are gonna be spitting at me, and they both do a lot of damage. If I get lit on fire, it's like I could be on fire for an hour, right? Depending on the demon. Like, I know some of them last for a really long time, so... Uh... Like, it might be nice to... Like, if, if we do sit it out this way, and I'm shooting back this direction, with them coming up here to the door, like, we can set it around that way. Somebody's broke a block out there. I don't know if they're banging on the building over there, or if they're banging on my building, but a block broke. Um, but yeah, like, if we're shooting back this way, I could also have, like, a side door that can shoot them in the back as they're kind of running along to come up to the door to, to attack me. So maybe this becomes, like we take these two out, these two blocks. This becomes like slits that we can see through this way to shoot them. And we put like doors or something here so they got to break through to get to me. And all I have to do is sit here and shoot them in the back while they're trying to get around to get to me. And we can put up a series of doors or more of these hatches. We use the rampway around. I gotta think about that. Yeah. Something where they're not seeing me directly. Like that guy, that um, behemoth, was like swinging straight through here in to get me. Right? So I don't know. Can you tell I'm worried? Sun's almost down. It's almost time to die. I mean, fight the zombies. <laughs> if we get a bunch of behemoths tonight, it could go real bad. So, I don't know. If it goes really, really bad, um, depending on what time of the night it is, it is, if it's before midnight and it goes super, super bad, then that'll be the end of the night. If it waits, if it's go about to like, oh, if it goes till about like, I don't know, Two o'clock, three o'clock in the morning, I'll restart the horde. Depending on what our situation's at. Come on, fuckers. Oh, 
Oh, hey, buddy. Don't lag. Come on, you bastards. This thing, just even one of these is like enough to just man like make the uh, flow of zombies manageable. That's what we want to see right there. Those nurses are the ones that give us the red papers. Cop exploded. Another cop exploded. Yeah, it's the spikes. Demo. God, these bikers have got a lot of armor. Come on, John, stick your head through. Come on. Thank you. Ooh, is that a red? Well, that was a red card, was it? I don't know. We'll hang on to it though. Ah, you monkey. Nope, no red cards. That sucks to be you, buddy. See ya. Oh, hey. Yeah, shotgun's still working. I mean, for these idiots, it's fine, right? Plus, you can sometimes one-shot them, which is nice. That's a demo. Did you get punted? Nope, it's not a demo. Not want to shoot AP there, but we were stuck with it. Wow, you guys see that monkey go by? Hey, 
so he died. Line you up. Get this replaced. Or I wonder if they're banging on shit down here. I'm on a solid block of steel, so I should be fine. Die, you bastard. Reloading. Come on, fall off. I shouldn't be looting while I'm doing this, but I am. They're banging on shit down there. Hop. Ooh. Armor didn't help you there, did it? Oop. Got him. Gonna use that. That's the one that we picked up. It's gonna get really bad when there's multiples of those at the door. Ah, nothing very good in there. I should maybe look into getting um, more um, more wire. Electric wire. Just to get a bit more, um, a bit more time between when the, the zombies show up at the door and when I need to fight them. Like I could put a couple more in. That gun not working. Oh, whoops! Not immune to shotgun. And spider monkeys are not immune to shotgun. Come on, you bastard. I should have brought more. Well, I got lots of shotgun ammo left. I should have brought more, but we're doing all right. Ooh, you guys learned your lesson. Our outside hatch is gone. Yeah, our outside is hatch is really gone, so... I gotta be really careful now. This is still on its third... Yeah, it's on its... It's the behemoths that wreck it, right?
I'm liking this shotgun now. Come on, John, stick your head through. God, thank God for fast reloads. This is getting intense. Hearing multiple explosions down below. I think it was a few of the dogs that went off. Looks like it's slowing a little bit. Oop. I have no idea how much, how many hit points that's got left. Ah, they're still coming. So I got number of horde zombies set to um, sixteen. Want to make sure those guys are dead. I don't feel like I'm wasting ammo because we got so much of it. Nice. Come on, John. Take your head out, John. One shot, I'll take it clean off. Come on. Okay. Yes. Ooh, another first aid kit. So the door is down to its second. Ooh. I think I suckered him into that. The door is down to its second leg, meaning that if we get a, uh, oh, Jesus. If we get a behemoth, he's going to blow right through this door. Come on. Yeah, man. Yeah, we doing okay. Rinse these fucking guys. That was a, uh, a, uh, what do you, what do you want to call it? A de decapitated biker? Not a decapitated biker, you know what I mean. A delegged biker. Oop. Nothing worse than a click. Come on, you fucker.
That guy's doing something over there. Yeah, man. Headshots for the win. We doing all right. Like I said, all it would take is a couple of angry behemoths. Been quiet in the flight pattern too. Like I haven't heard any birds. There's the morning. We did it. All right, it should be cleanup mode now. Ooh, see ya. That was a twofer. Ooh, good night. One dollar. You're gonna come with tucking money, but I come with more than that, buddy. My show is like to die for. Come on, you bastards. I wonder if we should start rocking the shotgun and going into POIs. I don't know. There you go. Two lead, huh? Got a handful more. Big Mama's got no arm. Oh, he didn't make it. On you guys. All right, let's switch it up. That should be it. All right, let's turn this off. So I think there's some assholes outside. Or maybe not. It's all quiet out here. It's all quiet. Ooh, can we just rinse that horde? I think we just rinsed that horde. Okay, not a lot of damage on the outside. They did break a block here. It's going to give me a chance to update the inside there. Yeah, I don't know what the hell happened to that guy. He was probably shooting at somebody. And they kind of Maybe it was like a cop, cop bombing or something that blew him up. Alright, so we need to do... It was... Triggered. Three second delay. Right? Triggered. Two seconds. Right? Right? Yeah? Alright, let's loot. We can actually loot here. Okay, we're going to throw some stuff inside here. We're not going to have enough room for all this, but... Come on. Come on! There we go. Alright, let's see what we got here. All right, well, we grabbed most of the stuff during the horde. We didn't get a lot down here, though. All right, I have no idea how much damage that took. So we got, I don't know, a few things. Nothing major, I don't think, but we do have a bunch of stuff to sell. 
Uh, mini bikes we don't need. I know we got a couple of uh, a couple of schematics. One there. Hazmat we can scrap in the workbench. Scrap those. Yeah, I mean, it's all sellable stuff. Oh, another one here. Don't think we got any red pages though. So, where did her treasure map go? Nicole's is over that way. I popped that one last night. Or yesterday. Where did the other one go? Oh, Sarah's is up there. So, I mean, not too, too far away, I guess. We'll probably find some way up there. Alright, guys, I'm going to end this episode here. Oh, how did you guys get down here? I don't know. Something happened. Something happened on the way to the gym, apparently. Um, so I'm going to uh, end this episode here, guys. I'm going to get stuff organized, and then tomorrow we'll figure out what we're going to do, okay? So I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.